So the last time we did this kind of video, uh, reacting to bright side videos, uh, I didn't have the best setup, and because of that, the video itself just kind of didn't, it just didn't turn out very well. I'm not, I wasn't very proud of it. So I decided to do it again with more people. Instead of just me and Steven, we have an entire cast here. We have Cozy from the YouTube channel Cosmics. We have Jamie from the YouTube channel Old Shipping Lines. We have the Lego, Lego guy from the YouTube channel Lego guy. And then we have the Ocean Channel. So if you want to check them out, then I, I'll be putting a link to their videos in the description. What's poppin' YouTube? Hey, it's Cosmics from the YouTube channel Cosmics. I'm crazy with it, you know what I'm saying? We make all types of different travel history, including boats, trains, planes, and automobiles. We also so talk we about random events like 9-11, Pearl Harbor, you know what I'm saying, guys? Like, abandoned urban exploring, you know what's up. All right, go subscribe right now. If I don't have a thousand by the end of the year, I will be committing a whole entire arson amongst Arkansas. So hello, everybody. <laughs> My name is Jamie from the old shipping lines. Um, my content is basically um, ocean liner content, also sometimes content about uh, naval types of ship, uh, ships, but mostly uh, ships that are more obscure. So if you want to subscribe, that would help the channel a lot. Uh, so yeah, that's me. Yeah, he just said a thousand subscribers, so congratulations. Hey, uh, that's a great hey, I'm sorry for coughing so much, my buddy O's. Oh, I do fine. have it's lung fine. cancer at the moment. <laughs> Okay, Ocean Channel, you're done. I have an intro. <laughs> Hello, I do videos on more obscure ships, just like the old shipping lines, but I also do videos on Hong Kong and stuff going on there, as well as just whatever I'm interested in. Yeah. Steven, you don't get an introduction. You had an introduction last yeah, video. Yeah, go fuck yourself, asshole. <laughs> no, I didn't. The start of the video was you, you, you cursing. You're, 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 in the the league, you're in the Little League, pal, okay? You're in the Little League. Okay, fine. Hello, everyone. I am a history enthusiast, and I study ancient and medieval history. I think that's all you need to know. Fuck yep. off. Alrighty. So this time, we're going to be watching The Truth About Titanic has been revealed by Brightside, the 10 out of 10 uh, ocean liner YouTuber. I think they're honestly probably one of the best ocean liner YouTubers. Yo, the yellow light bulb is very smart. Actually, yo, today's sponsor is Pick Rave for metastatic breast cancer. If you know a loved one that might have breast cancer. <laughs> yo, guys, just saying, just saying. Symptoms of high blood sugar. Fuck! Yo, guys, I think we should watch the second ad. <laughs> All right, guys. I am good at All right, buckaroos. I need to know are your seatbelts fastened and your ass is sat down. It is. No. Do you? Yeah. Who said no? Who the fuck said no? We're beginning, buckaroos. Shut the fuck up. In three, two, uno, espresso. Ah, scientists yeah. finally reveal the truth about the Titanic. The surface of the Atlantic Ocean. Albozo. The Titanic took like more than 1,500 lives video has with the it exact as it same sank to its watery grave. Talking yeah. about That's just because they just accept their, 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 their babies watching their hair pause The cause of this... Just because they're, they're all the babies <laughs> watching their videos, they're just like, I, I, I can't remember. What, what happened to Titanic again? I don't remember. I just need to be reminded. Yo, can we rewatch this video. intro? I forgot already. We'll tell you the whole truth that has been buried for over 100 years. I swear at if they remember the whole fire theory, feet, again. Nine blown off daily. The Titanic photo the on the bottom and the top photo. The smokestacks were placed at a 30 degree angle. I think that'd be like even more a astonishing and impossible. Facts. Bro, I can't tell if this is like an actual dude speaking or an automated with voice. No safety ropes. It's a real person. But these people needed oh, money no. to support their fam. Ah! Oh! We all know how lazy he is when it comes to editing. Nah, what do you mean this is W editing? They got a whole team of facts. people behind us. They just us. go to their Titanic wiki. Hmm, eight people died. Write that down. Uh, the ship was this long. Uh, smoke sacks were this high. I forgot. What's no. Thing is that I've seen this a lot with um, conspiracy theories and revolving around ancient um, civilizations. <clears throat> they use the same methods. And it's essentially this, what they do is that they'll take something from the general topic and then they'll get all these facts to essentially <coughs> trick a viewer into thinking that they know what they're talking about. And then they'll um, have the ridiculous theory and in their mind having all the facts before somehow seems to make it more valid. And what's even sadder is that it works. It um, does. 
Just look, just look at their fan base. Look at how many subscribers they have. An example. Screw Mr. Brightside. Kill him. I don't like to Okay, I think that's a little too far, Buckaroo. Anyway, back to Titanic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I didn't. Sorry, my brain kind of shit itself halfway through that. Spent on its creation, could that the original cause of the catastrophe was not ice, but fire. Let's go, uh, let's go. I knew it, they were going into this theory. Let's go. They already talked about the coal fire Journalist theory last month. Oh, boy. Coal was burning in the ship's hall. Okay, uh, okay. Uh, where do I start here? I think everyone knows that this theory is false. Uh, I can say something real quick. Sure. I looked at where the fire was, and if you look at the picture and where the ship was in the water, yeah. apparently the fire was, it was above the water level. Yeah, it's, it's almost like the photo the is over 100 up. years old. Yeah. If you guys think that, uh, uh, I was gonna say, if you guys think that Titanic, uh, Conspiracy theories are bad. You should see 9/11. They make no sense. Oh my God. Oh, have you ever, did you ever watch the Shane Dawson conspiracy theories on 9/11? Was I don't even like want to know. Theory. Yeah, the cat fucker was the one who made the 9/11 conspiracy theory. Oh apparently. <laughs> yeah. I think I think you should definitely be believing the cat fucker over actual historians. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I, I mean, this it's TikTok right. watchers do that. That's what TikTok watchers do. TikTok watchers, watchers see one video and they're like, that's what I know, I'm smart. Yeah, you have no idea how many people from like my school or from my family have come up to me and be like, hey, did you hear that actually Titanic uh, didn't sink? It was her sister Olympic. I've yeah. heard that people ask me that so many times and it's so annoying. I just start sending them uh, like photos that I have pre-made <laughs> that, that explain why it's dumb instead of me wasting as, my time. As, as I tell someone that I study Egypt and then they start Titanic. talking to me about aliens. I like aliens. If I may, it's also very funny that you that you say that enthusiast because there's so many people who actually believe it. That's a scary. <laughs> Yeah, just look yeah. at their fan base. Look at how many people like liked this video. Matt, it was a um, little tall. Another thing that I just want to mention is that. They make a big deal about Titanic being the biggest ship in the world, but it never really actually got fanfare at the time. It's sister did Olympic because yeah. it was the first in the class. Yeah, That's technically, how, like, like, Titanic did not get <laughs> nearly as many fanfare as Olympic. The most uh, uh, notoriety she got uh, during her main voyage in the beginning was her almost colliding with the SS America in, uh, in Southampton. I mean, you could also, you could also, like, refer that to almost every single, like, ship. ship. Like, it's... Yeah, it's like it's like phones. Like every year, a bigger and better <laughs> one comes out. It, it's not a big deal if it's tight, especially if it's just like her sister Olympic. Canceling the trip seemed out of the question. So to conceal the truth, the ship was turned in such a way that the marks from the fire faced away from the docks toward the sea. Bruh, come on, the passengers come could on. see this. No. Come on, no. there are so many photos of Sam Titanic's needs starboard to side. To this. this is baloney. <laughs> yeah, but Come then on. you know what there that. There are so many photos of Titanic on her starboard yeah. side during her maiden voyage, and even during yeah. her, her test trial. Also, this is, e this bullshit. even if, even if the the way the ship turned did obscure the fact, it's a simple fact that the ship needs to turn like that to leave. He he just yeah. makes them sound evil with the end ship. How dare they do that to that little boat? <laughs> little. It's very little. Yes, it's very little. I mean, yeah, I do have one that can fit my bathtub. Yo, 9-11 boy stepping back in here. If you think about it, in like another 60 years from now, there's gonna, like, 9-11 is going to be like Titanic where they market it and lie about it. I mean, they already lie about it, but... They already, they already do. <laughs> like, just to a larger extent, because now there's people that were actually there that won't be able to uh, chime in. I am kind of excited to see what video games people make about the 9-11 in the future. And there's the, uh, uh, the, uh, Nicolas Cage movie. <laughs> oh my god, I watched that! It was so bad! The interior of the Titanic oh, was yeah. based on that at the Ritz Hotel go. in London. I mean, boogie in right now. The staircase went down seven of out of the ten to get ready Beauty for dinner. Salon shows image they had an onboard movies. newspaper called the Atlantic <laughs> Daily Bulletin. There was even a special place for first- Hey, yo! It said come! <laughs> what? It says come! <laughs> where, 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 where? In the bottom left! Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can do that. Come or expendi. You wanna, Chris, if you wanna make sure that the next Osama bin Laden isn't killed, then donate. What the fuck? Oh no, I see, I see ads in three seconds. Yeah. Yo, let's go, another ad, let's get that! Let's get that! 
<laughs> what is it gonna be about now? Yes, metastatic breast cancer. In those times, so to detect threats ahead of a liner, special people kept watch using binoculars. <laughs> it wouldn't have though. It wouldn't have though. Yes, it would have. Shut up, guys. The yellow light bulb knows all. Stop. <laughs> They were falling behind schedule, and this was. Wait, hold up. That confused me. Was there was there actually a speed limit for ocean liners since when? I don't know. <laughs> Never. Yo, I hate it when the. Yeah, <laughs> I, hate it. I hate it when the I African boat pirates pull up as police officers and tell me to slow down my ship. If there was a speed limit, then the blue ribbon wouldn't be a thing. Shut up. Yeah. No, the blue ribbon was for cheaters. <laughs> you just told me to shut up. Yes, sir. <laughs> Damn. You got a problem with that? Nah, you wanna fight, bro? You wanna fight? Square up! No, you can't. So, I would like to know, did we have a speed limit on the ocean? No. no. FUCK! How criminal. Planned to equip the ship with only 48 boats. Uh oh. But eventually, the number was reduced even more to 20. <laughs> I feel like I, this, we're saying exactly what we did in the last video. It wasn't criminal. It was the standards. It was no, standard as in shut up. You don't know what you're talking about. Actually, the yellow light bulb knows all. I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> no, okay. you don't. It was actually the standard was 16. They put more than what, what was the standard. They definitely should have put more, but at the time, it, it wasn't criminal. They were just following the regulations. Didn't realize that they so, were in grave so danger. It's just so me because I know all this. In 2012, like this. I have to to researchers found out. I don't understand my brain. His first exam in navigation. <laughs> Eventually, he passed. <laughs> but who knows? I think I need help. Maybe this Tony is ignoring the emergency flight. Hey the yo, this is like some Tony Hawk shit right now. Look at the angle on that. Oh, I didn't <laughs> notice that. Yeah. Look yeah, at that. the angle be crazy. Yeah, no, that's, that's about right. I think that's if about right. If you were to take the ship out of water, you would realize that, like, a no, 60, that's, more that's like correct. 70 percent of the ship is suspended. Shut up! In air. Shut up! That's that's <laughs> not that's not correct. The Titanic is yellow. There, it's factual. Yeah, the yellow light bulb knows all. Yo, it might. Yo, I got a mind blowing. I got a mind blowing theory for you. This guy might be just re-uploading the same content, naming it something else. Whoa. They just like copy and paste pieces of their scripts from past Dude, you videos know what <laughs> just make a new video with My it. favorite That's part of this royalty free yeah, is like... At least they got this correct. The whole Mirage effect did have a big impact. I talked about this in my own video, but it did have a big impact on the Titanic sink, uh, hitting the iceberg. Yeah. Yeah, but um... Yes. I'm not gonna lie guys, the best part about this video is the royalty free horror music that's playing. Yeah. Oh, uh, I'm glad that <laughs> Historic Travels decided to upload a video. Just... Whatever it was, it took the lives of hundreds of people and still keeps the minds of scientists busy to this day. Uh oh. What no, theory about the catastrophe do you believe? Share your opinion Everyone in the comments below. Everything. Let's go! It's only, he's Open only saying this to one because of the he's trying to been cater to the people over. who are Give stupid us a and don't up. understand basic, If this video uh, gets 15,000 likes, hey, that's we'll me. tell you Yo, 15,000 likes! <laughs> Like Yo, let's get this video to 15,000 quadruple likes. They make wonderful content. If you don't, the yellow light bulb will show up at 3.45 a.m. in your bedroom and completely tell you all of the things that are truthful about the Titanic. No. Um, my final verbect is it. Uh, verbect? Yes, verbect. Are you the ship enthusiast? Yeah. Yes, I am. Uh, hi guys, welcome oh, to the Ship Enthusiast chill? channel. I am recording this video right now, so if anything is horribly done, that is because of me. You're welcome. Also, I'd like to give my final verdict of about 11 out of 10. Absolutely very informational and no lies at all. It just blows my mind how there's always a lack of research in his videos. Nah, what you mean? I'm baffled by the amount of research he puts into these. It's genuinely impressive. Yo, what's her name again? <laughs> Which one of us? There's a lot of people. Ah, uh, the me. the one with the Britannic. Uh, ship enthusiast. Uh, you mean you? You're the ship enthusiast. Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry guys. Um, all right, yo, listen guys, ship enthusiast here. What's good, G's? Uh, we just watched this brand new TTV Cribs. Uh. Bright side channel. Make sure to always believe in the yellow light bulb. Also, make sure to come subscribe to Cosmics and join his Discord server. Also, make sure to watch his two hours of full fledged bullshit on the world trade center i'm sure it'll be worth your time and you'll never want to fucking hang yourself again trust um <laughs> don't have a blessed day
I'm blowing up Arkansas. So guys, we forgot to add in the absolutely giggity goggity part of the video where we talk about our verdicts or verbix. I'm not sure how to say it on God. Um, so I uh, we're starting off with we're starting off with the gray and white drawing of a boat. Can you please start? Whoever the fuck you are. Who's that? Oh, oh shit, there's I'm, two of them. Uh, mine is the one the one over there. That's helpful. <laughs> No worries. I think he's talking about me. I think he's talking about me. Okay. Yeah. I think uh, just my. Bl I'm just Wait, a random. Wait. State your name, asshole. Call. Stay. Not, state your name and um, occupation. Uh, I'm a uh, ship guy. 1916. Bullshit. Anyway, my final verdict is that bright side is bad. All right, no, we're not gonna count that verdict. <laughs> all right, whoever's got the whoever's got the cat with like cream all over its mouth. Despite laughing at it, in all seriousness, it's honestly sad that this is the sort of misinformation that we have to deal with. And Fake like news. Alright, moving on. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Olympic guy. Uh, um, verdict. Subscribe to me and uh, the channel. Alright, right shut the fuck friends. up. You're not- that's not going in the video. <laughs> Skipping on to me, the absolutely beefy and oily dude known as Kazi Wazi. How's, how's it going, guys? Actually, my name's Ship Enthusiast in real life. Um... So like this motherfucker over here with the Britannic drawing stole my real name and occupation. Uh, I give the verdict 11 out of 10. If I could, I would put it up to even a thousand, but fucking assholes won't let me do that. So I have to stay in my lane. You know what I'm saying? All right, moving on to the next guy with the officer. Um, I think it's just hugely disrespectful. No, this, but no, but actually, actually, in all seriousness, without laughing, it's just disrespectful. Um, I think that Brightside is just a big cash grabber. He doesn't give a shit about hey, language. Family. Language. He doesn't give a crap oh, about. <laughs> he doesn't give a crap about his viewers. I think he's just a disgusting channel to look at. That's me. I don't believe you in any way, shape, or form. Moving on to the boat. Uh, me. Yes, sir. Or, um, Mr. Bright, he's like that guy who just watches somebody on a history channel and then says, I should do that, and he just does that all the time. Well, what's your final verdict? <laughs> uh, he sucks and he deserves to die. Alright, a little too <laughs> far, guy. A little too far. I, lo I love the all right. coming out of the mouth of a 12-year-old. Alright, Hong Kong. How's it going in China? I... I'm in Canada now, but anyways, I, Too bad. I think Brightside is really disrespectful, and this is the second worst video he's ever made. Uh, apart from that, the other one to the side, uh, it was not a nice burg, that one. Nah, no, you're oh. wrong, you're wrong. Um, I, disliked uh, your, I disliked your comment and <laughs> the reply. It's fine, I, you, you're just a hater. <laughs> I, and haters are good <laughs> for this channel. Oh my god. Alright, uh, history, Border Hopper. Bringing old sh I mean, bringing history back to life. Border Hopper, I'd like to get your verdict, your final verdict. They're the best channel of all time. That's what's up. See, at least he gets what I'm saying. Alright, that's what's up, Giggity Gang. <laughs> We're done with this video. Uh, shut up. See y'all. It's I'll my turn. With my next shut video up. Alone. No, what yo, I mean? what's poppin', YouTube? I mean, we'll, we'll see you later, YouTube. <laughs> Honestly, in all serious opinion, like, what actually is your thoughts on, like, these sorts of clickbaity videos of not I just Bright Side and Titanic? I have the same that you said. I don't really have much to elaborate on. I've, I've already given my opinion. You've already given your opinion. Uh, Kazi's yeah. already given his very, very honest opinion. So. Yeah. Now, okay, another question I have. Like, do you think that there is any way to solve misinformation that happens in history um i mean yeah just we need to be educating people more or we need to be youtube needs to be recommending tiktok all that needs to be recommending people's algorithm actual accurate stuff that is credible and not clickbaity stuff that is talking about mm. the olympic titanic switch theory even if it's not but even if the video or the person making the video isn't saying that these theories are true in the end, like bright side, they always say, well, we don't actually know. It's uh, it's still like spreading misinformation and people will fall for it either way. It doesn't matter if you say it's not true. People will still yeah. fall for it if they just yeah. hear it. And another thing is that do you, do you think you like as a channel um, 
and I know, like, admittedly you run a sort of small channel, but do you think even though uh, you have a small channel, um, do you think that the difference that you make by making these videos is worth it? <sighs> yes, I think I have. I mean, you see some of my videos, we have the Why the Britannic Movie Sucks video. I think that's a pretty, that's a pretty popular video. Obviously, there's a lot of hate on that video by little tiny people, uh... <sighs> But I think my videos are making a minor difference oh. in the ship community, mostly the more oh. popular ones. Specifically, the video I'm most proud of and I think is making the most impact is the uh, Can We Raise a Britannic Wreck video. That's made probably, yeah. it has so many views now. Oh. Uh, yeah. Now speaking, now speak, going back onto that, um, what that br first Bright Side video that you and I did, well, it is done in a sense, at least in my opinion, is set up a chain reaction, even if it's only just started, with historic travels starting to do similar content. And if this sort of chain reaction spreads of debunking, like, how do you feel about that? Like, do I you hope care I hope it happens. We already have historic travels. Yeah. Like after we made our video, which immediately wasn't amazing, but I think it it did it, it did a good job at least exposing some of their worse yeah. content basically all their content but then we have historic travels he comes and he makes mm -hmm. he just like uploaded his second video the other day on it uh yeah. and i've been wanting to make the second video since i first uploaded it i just i just wanted to wait till i got my new computer mm -hmm. uh and yeah and i don't think i'll ever do another video like this but i hope that other youtube mm -hmm. youtuber uh ocean liner and just ship youtubers in general maybe not just mm -hmm. not ship but other things that they're talking about that are misleading that people in those communities will be mm -hmm. able to debunk stuff like this uh, and so that other people know. I just hope that the YouTube algorithm and algorithms of TikTok, Instagram, other social medias will be able to uh, know and recommend the actual credible stuff. Do you think it's morally right to make videos about these tragedies full stop? Or do you think, or do you think that it's um, only not okay when it's exploiting the tragedies? Like, what's your I think that it? most of the time it's only really not okay if they are actively exploiting it, if they're trying to spread misinformation or they're just trying to make a buck off of it. If you're actually using it and trying to spread correct information and just trying to educate the masses about this kind of stuff, I mean, that's good. That's how we, that's how we learn from our mistakes is by spreading, the, is by spreading it and uh, educating everyone about it. And as the final question of this outro... What do you think of ancient aliens? <laughs> um, I don't care. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you gotta say the big, oily, beefy men known as Kazi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I introduce Jamie, who's the making the most lines, detailed World Trade Center the documentary. Channel. Uh. Yeah. If, if you don't get my World Trade Center documentary in there, I'm going to have a confusal in the comments. <laughs> okay, I'm fine with that. Okay, anyway. I'm joking, I don't care, I don't care. Just, it's whatever you want to put in there. So the last time we did this, uh, it wasn't the greatest thing ever. Boring! It wasn't the greatest thing. I had I had a pretty poor setup. It was only just me and Steven. Steven's mic sounded a little quiet. So... <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> You got me to laugh there. It's fine. Sorry, was I, sorry, was I being disturbed? Yeah, this, you know, you know, the thing is, I'm gonna find a way to edit this into the video. This opening. Oh, no! Anyway, right now, anyway, anyway, anyway. So yeah, uh, so I have a new setup. I have OBS. Uh, audio you sounds actually good. Again, bitches. <laughs> I think we should retake. No, it's fine. It's okay, fine. I can on, just I'm continue done. rolling. I'll edit it all into the. I'll edit it. Cut it up into nice little pieces. It's just gonna hear anyway. me say, if you subscribe, you get bitches. <laughs> but this time I have a new setup. Uh, I'm using Server OBS. Item. And, uh. Oh my gosh, y'all, stop talking! Shut the fuck up! I don't give you. a poopy! I'm gonna tell your mom, bro. I'm gonna tell your if mom. If you tell mom, I am making sure that you have less than two hours on the Xbox this week. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so, uh, this, okay, shut up, let's go, okay, shut up, shut up, so last, My uh, okay, shut up, okay, so now I have a better setup, uh, I'm using OBS, <laughs> it should sound good, I swear to hell, I'm gonna mute all of you, this is why we say go on deafen, okay, so, um, the people, we have, so, I, I brought some extra people on today, 
Uh, we have Cosmix, uh, uh Cosmi from the YouTube channel. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. This is gonna be hard. <laughs> Dude. Okay, hey, okay. Yo, can we okay, just do me... a normal intro? Hey, yo, please? guys, actually, I gotta go eat Denny's. I'll be back. <laughs> Denny's. Okay. Who the fuck goes to Denny's? <laughs> okay, anyway, okay. Y'all, yeah, shut Denny's. up. I'm gonna. Okay. Oh, Alright. So, we, I brought some extra people on today. Uh, We have Cosy from the YouTube channel Cosmix. He's making. He does 9 11 content if you're into that sort of thing. Oh, He's making nah, a 9 11. That's disrespectful. <laughs> He's, he makes a. Uh, <laughs> He's working on a 9-11 documentary. <laughs> no, it's not 9-11, it's the World Trade Center site from 1943 all the way up till the present and future. Oh. Uh. <laughs> okay. Get your shit correct, bozo. <laughs> okay. And then we have, uh, we have Jamie from uh, the YouTube channel Old Shipping Lines. Uh. <laughs> okay, he makes, uh, he makes ship content. He's kinda like me, except he work, he focuses on more obscure ships. <laughs> <laughs> this is the magic of editing. It's like I can edit all of your crap out. Oh. Fine, I'll start over. I'll start over. Okay. Uh -uh. So the last time we did this kind of video, uh, I Lego guy, I swear to hell. So the last time I did this video, uh, it wasn't the greatest setup. Uh, it did not sound good. <laughs> Fuck. I messed that up. <clears throat>